Good day everyone, welcome to Senior Pablo TV. And for today's tutorial video, we will be discussing writing linear equation 2.4. So after discussing the point slope form, that is in the form y minus y sub 1 is equal to m quantity x minus x sub 1. Now we have the 2.4. The form y minus y sub 1 is equal to y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. Quantity x minus x sub 1. In our previous lesson, we discussed that the formula in getting this slope, if we have two points, is y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. This is our formula. Notice that if we're going to substitute this formula to m here, we can get the point slope form. That will be the relationship of the two, the point slope form and the two point form. So you're going to choose if you're going to find this slope first or you're going to use directly the 2.4. Uh, 2.4. It's okay. It's up to you. Now let's try this example. A line passes through the following pairs of points. 3 comma 4 and 4 comma 7. Find the equation of the line in standard form and slope intercept form. Determine the slope and y intercept. So copy the given, 3, 4, and 4, 7. Let us name it as x sub 1, y sub 1, and x sub 2, y sub 2. So it's up to you if you're going to use the 2.4, this form, or you're going to get first this loop. Now let's get this slope first. So m is equal to the formula y sub 2 minus y sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. Then substitute. So y sub 2 is 7 minus y sub 1 is 4 over x sub 2 is 4 minus x sub 1 is 3. So we have 7 minus 4, that is 3, over 4 minus 1, 1. Uh, 4 minus 3, which is 1, or simply 3. This will be our slope. Now, after getting this slope, we can go to the point slope form. So copy y minus y sub 1 is equal to m times x minus sub 1. y minus y sub 1, that is 4, is equal to m is 3, and x minus x sub 1 is 3. So copy y minus 4 is equal to distribute 3 times x, that is 3x, 3 times negative 3, negative 9. Now we write into slope intercept form y is equal to 3x minus 9 move to the right now we can pass to 4 addition property of equality y is equal to 3x negative 9 plus 4 that is negative 5 this will be our slope intercept form in a slope intercept form, we can get the slope of 3 and of course the y intercept negative 5. Now let us get the standard form. So copy y is equal to 3x minus 5. So negative 3x plus y is equal to negative 5. Move to the left, it will become negative 3x. So we need to a positive value for a. So multiply this by negative. So 
dx minus y is equal to positive y. This will be our standard. Now, in our slow, a point slow form, we use x sub 1 and y sub 1 as our point. What if we're going to use the x sub 2 and y sub 2 to substitute in our point slope form? Let's say y sub 1 minus uh, y minus y sub 2. Let's say this one is equal to m times x minus x sub 2. We're going to pick this value or this point. We're just going to check if we will come up with the same answer. This is just an experiment. So y minus y sub 2 is 7 is equal to our m is 3 times x minus x sub 2, 4. So y minus 7 is equal to 3 times x, that is 3x, negative uh, 3 times negative 4, negative 4, 8, 12. Y is equal to 3x minus 12. Move to the right to combine like terms. That will become positive 7. So y is equal to 3x minus 12, negative 12 plus 7, negative 5. Are they using? Ah, yes. Okay. They're the same. So it's okay with whether what point you're going to use. So that is on how to write linear equation given the two points. Two point form that is related in our point slope form. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV. Your next lesson, writing linear equation using the x and y intersect. See you.